Manchester United got their Champions League campaign off to the best possible start with a convincing win over FC Basel at Old Trafford. But an away trip to Moscow, that is a different kettle of fish altogether. Man United fans have great memories from Moscow, but this time we're playing CSKA. Man United in outstanding form at the start of this season. But who will Jose Mourinho pick in, as I said, in what is set to be the hardest game in the Champions League in the group stages for Man United? Here is my predicted 11 for the game. In goal, David De Gea will definitely come back in. Sergio Romero's going to play well when he plays, but this is the Champions League. We need Dave in goal. Now, at right back, I've gone for Matteo Darmian. Will Antonio Valencia start or will he be switched in and out of games? I think we'll see him switched a lot this season just so he's fresh and prime for the Premier League. Maybe he will start against CSK Moscow, but I'm predicting that Darmian will start. Centre-back partnership, I'm going for Lindelof and Chris Smalling. Now, I'd like to see Lindelof alongside Phil Jones or Eric Bailly, both who are back from suspension, but I think Mourinho will try and keep these partnerships going. So play Jones with Bailly and play Lindelof with Smalling. Because as a centre-back, you need to play with a partner to really start building a relationship. And that's what I think we'll see Lindelof and Smalling with Ashley Young at left-back, who's been fantastic, being the best left-back we've seen at left-back for a while. I don't think Luke Shaw will be starting his first game for Man United in some time away at Moscow. Maybe he'll come on in the second half of the game. Now, in midfield, there are question marks. Obviously, Fellaini's not travelled with the squad, but Matic has travelled, which tells me he's available. And for me, I would put Matic in this game. We need to try and control possession as much as possible against Moscow. You don't want a match where we're chasing the game, and to do that, we need possession and retention of the ball. So that's why I think playing Matic alongside Herrera makes, it makes the most sense in midfield for Manchester United. That's where we're going to keep the most possession, and that's where we should be able to control the game. Now for a front three behind the striker, I've gone for Lingard, Mkhitaryan and Martial. Lingard out on the right, Mkhitaryan in the middle and Martial out on the left. The ability of Mkhitaryan to run from deep with the ball will play into United's style, I think, in this game. There's nobody better in, in the team, as far as I'm concerned, with carrying the ball at his feet than Mkhitaryan. So if he, can, if he can pick the ball up just inside United's half or just inside CSK Moscow's half and run at the defence with the ball, that's going to create the space that Lingard and Martial can exploit. And with Lukaku up front, United are looking deadly at the moment. He's just been in fantastic goal-scoring form. An outstanding start to his Manchester United career. Martial's banging in goals too. Lingard's got on the score sheet. Mkhitaryan's getting goals and assists. And then we've also got Rashford and Mata to throw in there when we need to. Man United attack looking brilliant at the start of this season. But for me, the... The biggest priority for this Moscow game is control of the possession and making sure that Moscow don't dictate the game. If we end up chasing the game, that's where you're going to start getting injuries, going to be cold, the pitch might be hard. You want Man United to go through this as smoothly as possible. And to do that, I feel we need to keep the ball at our feet more often than not. That is it for my predicted 11. Who will be in your team? Let me know in the comments below. As always, subscribe to the United People's TV if you're new. We'll see you soon. Take it easy.